Okay, okay. So, let's talk about uh, El Compa Rubio's build. This from El Compa Rubio. It's getting an Alpine 10 inch screen. Now, we see a lot of people asking us, that shit don't fit. And we see comments saying, no, they make a nine inch kit. What, 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 what do we tell them? Where you need, bro. It <laughs> makes you happy. It makes you happy. We got some ideas on how that thing's gonna fit, which I'll show you later. And uh, yeah. Man, what what else we got? Yeah. yeah. I did. He said oh fat. Bueno, no se va a ver como las otras. La pantalla la puedes poner. People are gonna go crazy. People are gonna be like, what the hell, big boy? No, no, we're gonna get the dreamers. How much is that? <laughs> Six thousand dollars. No, I'm good. No, no, they don't even touch that. Huh? Not even a thank you. Oh, yeah. All right, so let's go check out the car. <laughs> yeah, let's see what you guys get. All right, so I'm out here right now in the parking lot of our shop. I'm gonna show you the truck. <laughs> give you guys an idea of what's going on uh, because we, we, we're pretty much starting from scratch with this build uh, we're gonna be doing some subwoofers we got our 2w7 jail audio 13 inch uh, we're also gonna be doing one amp to each subwoofer a custom box on the bed which is gonna be designed and really elegant on the inside of the box we're gonna have some more designs which I'll show you uh, once we get the rendering done and on the inside of the truck Right here are where we're gonna be putting the doors, speakers. So we're gonna be building new doors to put in like maybe three or four sixes right here. On the top of the dash, we're gonna be doing some tweeters all across. Um, so a couple of tweeters there, a couple of tweeters on that side. Put the RST logo right in the middle. So this logo that's right here is gonna go down there. Uh, we wanna probably make a center console and the Alpine touchscreen is gonna go in here. So the complicated thing is uh, getting everything fitted and rendered. So we're gonna be able to get that, I believe so. So we should be good. Uh, we're also gonna be doing a design in the back. So this is what's back here right now. We're also gonna be the, uh, designing a, like a little panel for that. Um, we're gonna get rid of all this old cable. So I think they, this was in here when they, when they got the truck. It's really bad, it's embarrassing. T-taps. Everybody knows you're not supposed to use T-taps. But yeah, so that's some of the some of the ideas. Um, new headliner. So we're gonna, right here, this is gonna be gone. Adios. So those are the plans. Now, a lot of you guys know this truck as the Mamalona. <laughs> I, I kind of like that name. So we're we'll working on that. That's what we're gonna be working on. And as we go through the design process and all of the uh, stuff that has to be done, you'll be coming along with us. Okay. You know later <laughs> all right guys this is the build that we're going to be doing it's a dodge ram single cab oem stereo and this is the product that we're going to be installing okay we're going to go through the list we got the lc6i for the oem stereo we got an epicenter for the um base uh to make the bass sound better we got a four channel ds18 we got a two channel ds18 and we got a one channel ds18 the one channel is going to run the subwoofers this is going to run the outside speakers which these are some grill speakers from from uh, Jail Audio. Also, this one is for that. This one is for all the door speakers. We got four door speakers, and we have all the wiring that we're gonna be using. So this setup is gonna be clean, loud. Stick with me, you're gonna watch us do this job. It's gonna be an amazing build. Lewis is gonna be the one jumping on it, and uh, I think you guys are gonna like this one. Let's look at We're gonna start right here. Okay, this is the back. We're gonna remove all this so we can get the box in there. We're gonna uh, keep the factory radio on this belt. So we're gonna open this up and grab the lines from the speaker wire, the speaker line output. We're gonna go into the um, audio control piece and then that's gonna give us a good clean signal with a lot of voltage of the RCAs. Cool. There's three amp kits we gotta be putting on there. I believe so. Another thing that's gonna be really complicated is we have to put the speakers underneath the, the car. 
So we're gonna probably build some brackets for that. All right, guys, we're gonna be getting a time lapse of Lewis taking care of the fuse holders. You know how he does his thing with all the fuses. So let's see him. Let's see him try to take care of that. So what's your what's your plan, man, for the fuses? Put some brackets. So we're gonna make a custom bracket so we can mount all the fuses on it. We're gonna have Junior use his laser machine. Maybe put some audio system logo on it. No, I don't know. Maybe. I'm out here in the back with Junior. I'm gonna find out what he's doing to make that bracket that they're gonna be doing for the fuse blocks. Or oh, the fuse holders? No, that's on the All right, so right now he's on the computer. They got their dimensions. This is what he's gonna be building uh, for the, for the, to hold the fuses. So I'm sure they're utilizing this piece for the bracket. And then this is where they're gonna mount all the parts. He hasn't cut anything, so we'll be back. For right here in the seat. Oh, oh, we're getting closer. We're getting app location. Sorry for the noise. The lawnmower is in the bag, you know, testing his, his things. <laughs> Oh, that's actually working out perfect. One more. So that's working out good. So there's room for the two amps under here. And then the LC7 is just gonna put on that side. The box is gonna go right here. So, oh shit. All right, let's see what happens next. Dang, so they're moving along really fast on this car. So that's why I'm in here again. So they already got some of the power wires. This is the four gauge for the 3000 watt amp. And we got the two eights for the smaller amps. Is that where you're changing the application? No. Oh. Okay, so he already has the power will, wire. It would be nice just to put a, like a... You can just put power. a little a bracket, right? Eh, yeah. To bring it up. No, 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 it's okay. And surprisingly enough, we got another Dodge Ram in here. Let me show you this other one. We did a sunroof on this one back in the day, back a while ago. See, look at that. We did a sunroof, and then right now what we're doing is the, uh, the, the headlights. Right there, he's placing the bass knobs. Okay. <laughs> bass knobs. Got wires. This is the for the speakers, the amplifier power wire, the outside speaker wires. And then he's doing the bass one right there. I like it. You want to know what I'm into? We can start with a blindfold. You know the love goes deep, baby. Tell me what you info. I'm over the hill and under the brakes. Over the pain and under the faith. Over the past, I wash it away. Tell me if you're looking to stay. Yeah. Now we can get it in through the daytime. Or we can find a moon in the stateside. I know you got dreams we could chase, right? I wanna know what it tastes like. Tell me what's the motive you got it. It's hard kept, but it's more than a promise. The way you move got me leaning all on it. I wanna see you tomorrow. Talk to me. Intoxicated by you. Uh, All right, check it out. We're getting closer to the wire. How you feeling, right now, man? Hmm? How you feeling? Like what? Look at all these cables. Are you not confused? The cables over there, cables right here, cables back here, cables right there. I'm not confused. All right, he, has, he looks like he got the plan, man. Let's see if he can get it. You know what? I don't know, man. You no, know, Jay's here today. Well, you're the magic on the potion. Got me spilling out like an ocean. Don't, don't ask me what I want to do. Cause all I really want to do is you. Your red lips are so persuasive. Girl, it's like you speak in cursing. Girl, don't ask me what I want to do. Cause all I really want to do is you. I want to know what you're into. Like can you let the past go? I can tell by that heartbeat Your last dude was an asshole In and out like it's all of the time Commitment ain't even a thought on his mind 
You could settle, but the feeling ain't right. Tell me what you feeling tonight. Yeah. It's like we both need a rain check. Tell me I'm the one that needs saving. Tell me I'm the one with an angle. Driving through life that ain't paved yet. Through the good and the bad. And we can play it like a wish in a head. And we can play it like the future or past. Now tell me what you wish in your head, huh? Check it out, we're getting closer for this truck to being done. I want you to see, look at this. 3,000 watt amp, these levels. Um, the empty center, the 3,000 watt amp, the base knob fucking crew right there, that's a base knob crew. If you got three base knobs, you're a badass. Or I would say not base knobs, I'm gonna say if you have three line knobs, then you're you're, you're gangster. Louis, how you doing? Pretty good, Anthony, I'm fucking tired, but still, yeah, the LC7's there. We just finished that installation, which we saw the time lapse. But yeah, keep going, bro. You're almost there. That's the uh, adapter that we made. You guys saw that too? Nice. Cool. So look at, oh my God, it's it's already nighttime. This, you, can you believe he's been on here a whole 10 hours? What, nine hours? Nine hours so far. He's almost done. Who do you know can do that? All right, so speakers are in. We took out these factory ones. Took out the factory speakers. <laughs> that's bullshit. We don't have to erase that shit. <laughs> Why? <laughs> that way, people are gonna think we, that we can do it faster. All right. So everything is ready. Almost. He's been on all day. It's already nighttime. You can see it's dark. So the the LC7 hooked up. We got all the base knobs on deck. We got the base amp right here. Epicenter right there. Four channels. Both of them are over there. Did we do the grill speakers yet? Just the grill speakers are waiting for us. Um, yeah, he already changed them out. So that's done. <whistles> Mamma mia. Let me, let me show you the, the plate that we were making. See how it came out. Look. Look at that. Is that not cool? Can you see the audio system logo? That's smoking hot, man. That is smoking hot. Yo. Cool, cool. All right, guys. Looks like, looks like it's finally done, baby. But I want to show you guys the grill speakers. Let me see if I can get in there. Hold on. Oh, well, the sun is just so bad. The ah. All right, guys. So here are the grill speakers. You know they're pretty blended pretty well because they're darker and the the back tubing is gray. But that thing has a like a um, a tube in the back. I don't know, like a it's it's a tower speaker. Eventually, we just use that instead. That's cool. I like that. All right. At the end of the day, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. At the end of the day, it looks nice. Yeah. You look good. Amp, epicenter, the box. Wow, bravo, bravo. That is it, that is it. That was the end of the episode. That was a Dodge Ram we were working on. Uh, comment down below what's your favorite part of that build. Also, subscribe if you're not already subscribed and uh, hit that thumbs up too for the likes if that video was awesome. Cool, more details on Rubio's as soon as we start recording more footage. And you guys know, I know some of you guys want to see that build and I'll be working on my best to be documenting that. Cool, later guys. Thank you.